talk about. Make sure you've got Omni Channel. Uh, no, there, there are a lot of things. Omni Channel. There you uh, go. Used to be such a buzzword, I feel like. But uh, I'm. it's funny, I'm getting just old enough where I'm like, it's almost weird that you don't want to talk to a human. You just want to book a service. Like, I don't know who you are. I think you, you do drains. Why don't you come over to my house? But that, that's a consistent figure, that 50%. We've got a partner in the industry that their platform is you know, heavily used for scheduling home service franchise appointments. They, they quote almost the, the exact same figure. Like, yeah, it's about 50% of people that, that hit the website are booking or, or yeah. scheduling. It's, yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I wish we weren't still just talking about omni channel stuff, but it's like, it's so important. And you, you mentioned our industry kind of lags and how quickly they adapt and evolve. And the truth is, uh, in some of the categories, so we have the six brands. And in those categories, there are some where not a single compet- competitor has online booking, for example. Like where we, the industry as a whole lags. And so it is unsexy as omni-channel communication is, it, it's a huge differentiator if you do it right. Um, it's also not easy to do. The integrations, systems talking to systems, and in the franchising space, franchisees getting on board with any changes that have to happen to implement something like that. It's a big lift, but it's really important. It's I, w- I would just call it, it's like table stakes today. Mm-hmm. It The consumer is expecting it. The consumer, if they're coming to you for the first time, you've built up your brand, you've done a really good job of you know differentiating yourself in the marketplace of why your brand is special even in these commoditized brands like HVAC or plumbing, right? There's a bazillion plumbers out there. You, they've come to your website for a number of reasons, or they've come to your brand for a number of reasons, and they're selecting you because they think you're going to give them a good experience. Um, the first interaction has got to be either answering the phone, scheduling the appointment, giving them a, an ability to communicate with you. And uh, many brands are not, giving you know they're they're dropping off they've done all that work and now they've dropped off because they're only uh available nine to five or they're relying on voicemail overnight or whatever the the story is so it's 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 super important but not everybody's doing it very well 